everyone! I hope you are doing well. Today's video will be the final edition of our Friday Update series. We launched this video series to keep all of our friends and the loved ones of the people we support updated on our response to the pandemic. Now that case numbers are on a downward trend and vaccines are widely available, we will return to posting information on our website and social media accounts in a written format. Please continue to follow us on social media and at trinityservices.org for regular updates on our organization. This week, curriculum and materials regarding recognition were distributed to residential locations. People learned about different ways they can show recognition to brighten other people's days. They cooked healthy recipes together, identified what they like about themselves, designed pumpkins for Breast Cancer Awareness Month, shared positive notes with their friends, created wreaths for autism awareness, made cards to send to soldiers through Operation Gratitude, and more. Also this week, friends from the Wilmington area visited Big Run Wolf Ranch in Lockport to see the animals there. At New Lenox Woodworks, people made motivational signs and painted a wooden pumpkin. Housemates visited the Marr Theater in Wilmington, which donated tickets for the ladies to see the Adams Family, too. Reuben worked on his artistic talents. Kara celebrated her birthday. Friends made banana bread together. And people who attend Old Plank Studio stopped by Strides, Trinity's therapeutic horseback riding program, to celebrate Halloween. As a reminder, we are offering a free estate planning webinar at 7 p.m. this Tuesday, October 26th, in partnership with Financial Planning Ministry. You will be provided with the resources and assistance to create a special needs trust or a revocable living trust for free. To register, click the link in the post accompanying this video. We are collecting signups for our annual Giving Tree program for the people we support. Trinity provides residential support to 645 people with developmental disabilities and mental illness, and some of these people do not have contact with family members or the financial means to purchase items they want for the holidays. By spending just $30, you can make somebody's holiday brighter. To participate in the program, send your name, phone number, and town to givingtree at trinityservices.org. And we are also accepting pre-orders for our 2022 Art from the Heart wall calendar. The calendar features 12 original pieces of artwork created by the people we support. Proceeds benefit those we support. Calendars are $20 each with curbside pickup. Shipping is an additional $5 per calendar. To view a preview of the calendar and place an order, visit trinityservices.org slash calendar. We are happy to report that since our last update, there have been no new cases of the coronavirus among people we support or our staff members. Thank you for your ongoing support. Together, we are Trinity Strong.